do you know you can actually back up the secure folder to a flash drive or a USB storage? Let me show you in this video. This is my Galaxy S23. I will back up the secure folder to a flash drive and then restore it to my Galaxy S24. Yes, both phones need to be connected to the internet. Before starting, let me access the secure folder and show you what I have inside this folder. I have two photos, an additional CPUX application, and a PDF file. Yes, there isn't a lot of stuff altogether because I just want to make sure it doesn't take too long to back up and restore for this video. Now, let's connect the flash drive to this phone. Then, open the Smart Switch app. Tap the memory card icon in the upper right corner. Select USB storage. Since I just want to back up the secure folder, I will pick custom and tap next. Here, you need to deselect all the items. Then, select and go into apps. Here, you only need to select secure folder and tap done. Tap backup here and follow the rest of the on-screen instructions to start the backup. Now, the backup is done, so it's time to restore. This is my Galaxy S24. I have already signed in with the same Samsung account on this phone. I will start creating the secure folder, which includes setting the password and enabling the option to allow my Samsung ID to reset the password. Once it's ready, I will connect the flash drive with the backup files. Again, open the smart switch. Tap the memory card icon. Pick the backup you want to restore in the Restore From section. Here, you can leave the Everything option selected and tap Next. Yes, the restoration process begins. Once it finishes, access the secure folder to complete the restoration. Yes, I have the CPUX application. The photos, and a PDF file on this phone. The restoration is successful. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching.